Okay, I got a pretty interesting one here. This is just going to be a detailing challenge. Uh, 2013 Subaru cross truck got sprayed by a tar truck on the side of the interstate. Uh, the driver of the, uh, the tar truck had left the sprayer on on the side of the road when he parked the truck. Has absolutely covered this car. The whole front end the whole left side, a little bit on the on the right side that was exposed. Got the mirror, a little bit of the A pillar. Uh, it's got the entire roof covered the windshield, but he was able to wipe it off before it dried, so you could still see out. Uh, the mirror got it pretty good. It's all over the glass. Total mess. Insurance paid $1,600 for me to clean this up, so hopefully that'll be enough. Uh, factored in, replacing a few trim pieces, but hopefully I can get it cleaned without having to do that. Um, I'm going to spray some uh, Malco brand. Uh, it's called Target. I'll show you that in just a second. Picked this up from a local retailer. Uh, had to meet up with him. I couldn't buy it directly from the company, but... Uh, it's very similar to the prep saw I use already. I think the ingredients are very similar, but I went ahead and bought this just to try it out. It's supposed to be paint safe. So I'll, uh, I'll put it in my, my sprayer over here. I'm taking the prep saw out of this sprayer and letting it dry out. My handy spray. I can just pump this up and spray it so I don't burn my arm up trying to, trying to spray this with a hand, hand sprayer. But anyway, I'll soak the car with that. Let it sit for a while. He recommended letting it sit for about three or four minutes and then coming back and adding a little bit to it and then start scrubbing it. And I've tested one spot. Uh, this piece, this piece of trim here, I was going to replace. I cleaned it off that. It looks like it's going to be safe for that plastic. I am going to replace the cow panel uh, just because it's so large. It'll, it'll look better if I just put a brand new one in it. I cleaned this spot right here. It came off pretty well. Main thing is going to be getting it out of this groove here. And I'll follow the, the plastic trim and the rubber around everything without damaging anything. It'll be interesting. See you later.